Okay, so I'm here in Canada, first canoe trip of the year, and I'm with someone you haven't seen in a while. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so Noah and I are heading out uh, for a canoe trip, but unfortunately the weather sucks. Uh, as you can see in the background, we're getting heavy rain, raining all day, and yeah, thunderstorms expected. The weather report says uh, warnings of thunderstorms until two o'clock tonight. So just made the executive decision to pull over. We're gonna spend the night here in Halliburton, Ontario. And then tomorrow, well, around four o'clock tonight, it's supposed to clear up. So by tomorrow we can head out, and start exploring the wildlands. Okay, so we are in the wildlands, Queen Elizabeth Wildlands, Ontario. And we've been paddling down Devil's Lake. We just reached the first portage. Now it's a 1400 meter portage according to the map we're using. So yeah, it's gonna be a bit of a hike. We've already found that the bugs are fairly bad, active, which is a little surprising. Not surprising for mosquitoes and black flies, but there's deer flies out and they are bad and that's what's surprising, uh, being only the first week of June. So anyway, we're gonna get the gear out, we're gonna do the portage and keep on moving. A little bit of water on the trail.
tree hang up here. Yep, mosquitoes, lots of mosquitoes. Bit of a beaver dam. or if this is the portage. Okay, so we're in camp and for this trip I got the no bug zone, I think it's called, from Eureka. Not an endorsement or anything, just letting you know what we set up. It looks kind of wonky. Haven't set it up before, this is the first time. And uh, yeah, basically I knew the bugs would be bad this time of year and thought instead of being out here suffering, I use a hammock and I know it uses a little bivy. We'd be basically in our cocoons to stay out of them. I thought, get this so that we can actually sit down and hang out together. 
There's also a fire ban right now because of the widespread uh, wildfires throughout uh, the region, uh, northeast Ontario, Quebec, also out west. So yeah, no fire to keep the bugs away. So this is really the best option. A little bit extra to carry in, but not too bad. I, I got the poles for it. Getting bit by mosquitoes right now. Uh, I bought poles for it, but you don't need poles. You can set it up just with uh, guy lines to two trees. Uh, I'm using one pole at the front and then a guy line to the back, uh, as well as the corners basically stake it out. Uh, difficult to stake it out here because it's just rock, right? A little bit of surface dirt and that's it. So uh, used uh, top line hitches to tie to some roots and then strategically placed uh, tent pegs down through the tent loops and use roots when they were available to kind of just wedge them under. Should work. It's slightly windy, which is nice, keeping the bugs away, but it doesn't seem to be blowing the tent away. Anyway, we're gonna relax for a while and yeah, just enjoy the day. Go up the bug net and I will take you outside.
working on one. Okay, so I'm just sitting here filming the sunset and I look down at the water and the fish are jumping, but there is a gigantic turtle just floating by. I've only got my GoPro to see if I can get a shot, but I'll try.